Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Dia, and welcome back to some Call of Duty Modern Warfare Zombies. And before anything, I want to take a moment just to apologize for if there are any audio options or audio problems. I cannot get the audio to be any louder on my microphone when I go to record with the camera. And typically what I do is I record the microphone through OBS and then I record the gameplay through Shadowplay. Well, for some reason, Shadowplay is instantly killing my recording with my through the privacy options. Like it's I, I'm setting it to where I want to record everything that my desktop has to offer, and it's just denying it. Even when I turn off that share and private share option and privacy option, it is still instantly just denying it. So I want to apologize for that. And also, I want to say thank you guys for the most recent support on the videos. My Mother's Day video hasn't didn't go crazy, and that is to be expected. I kind of like it like that. It was an extremely personal video I made. It was intended for my mom, but I wanted to just go ahead and say thank you not only to my mom, but for all of the moms on Mother's Day. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you you know check out the video. I'll leave it uh, at the end of the video, or if you go to my channel, it'll be the next one. I'll also leave it at the top of the description. And yeah, other than like the Call of Duty videos have been going crazy, so I really appreciate it. Thank you guys, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, but today, I want to be honest, I didn't really do anything during my double XP weekend. I ended up like taking care of some personal business. I got done on Saturday and then I didn't play like at all. And so I'm just going ahead and I'm gonna go jump straight back into that grind. So it's something, something casual and I'm gonna talk about just some stuff, nothing too crazy. And I wanna apologize as well for the lack of Call of Duty videos. Recently, time has been absolutely just kind of insane it is much easier for me to record a vlog and edit it it takes me about if i can get my thoughts down and i can have some like prep time to make sure i can say what i want to say it takes me about i would say and just under an hour to create a vlog uh, if i'm running out of time but it, for these call of duty videos it takes me about three to four hours to create uh, once I sit down, record, and edit, and just go through all my footage, it takes me a little bit of time. I appreciate everything you guys are doing in terms of supporting the vlogs. No more vlogs for hopefully a very long time. I don't really enjoy uploading vlogs. I don't feel as if not only they're not engaging, but I feel like if I'm going to tell a story, I can tell it through these Call of Duty videos and, you know, give you guys something to watch, and I can do something while I'm also discussing whatever story I'm discussing. I've also been playing a bunch more story games recently. I've been really trying to clear out my backlog. I recently just finished Stray, the, the cat, the little cat idol game that you, you run around as a cat and you like help the robots and you have to open the top so you can so they can see the outside that was actually a really good game a really 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 good game i wish i completed it sooner because it took me about a month to complete and not because i was like failing or struggling but because i was trying to do content go to work and i was pretty much only playing call of duty so the little bits of free time i found recently i've been playing that game and it's been so much fun i highly Highly, highly recommend if you guys want that super relaxed, super chill experience. Play that. It's all, it's really short. It's like, f I beat it in four hours. I, I didn't bring two Aether Crystals for this because what I'm going to do is I'm hoping that by the time I have 10 grand and I have enough money to pack a punch, the grenade launcher, I can then just spend the money rather than, we have an escort all the way up to the right. I can go ahead and do that. Yeah, Stray, absolutely great game. If you guys haven't played it, I highly recommend it. It's not the most expensive game and it's not, it's got a pretty, honestly, unique learn to it. it not many games are gonna sit there and give you the same or at least similar experiences that Stray is gonna give. Sorry if I seem all over the place. I actually just woke up from a nap. This fucking game is atrocious, I swear. You know, if I'm a bit bit foggy in the head and I'm just like, if my speech is a bit bleh, because my head is hurting a little bit. I've also started moving. I also start moving into the new place tomorrow and I've already packed a bunch of stuff in the, in the car ready to just take it. So I'm hoping that when the actual time like move in day rolls around and everything needs to be, I guess, finished for the most part, I can, I'll roll in. I'll buy my desk, which I'm buying a super fancy, expensive desk. I'll explain why about that in another video, but I'm buying this really nice, really expensive desk. I'm, I'm looking, I'm really looking forward to it, but I really want my move-in day to be, because I'm moving in on Memorial Day weekend, the 25th of May, which I didn't realize is like a week and a half away. I'm very much like, holy shit, I didn't realize it was that close. I want everything to just be done. I don't want to spend all of Saturday doing that and then all, all of Sunday and part of my, part of Monday just moving in. I want to enjoy my weekend somewhat i don't think i'm gonna be able to go for all of the mastery charm challenges that i want to do at least for modern warfare 2 i don't even know if i'll be able to do it for modern warfare 3 because i have like such i guess a, a little time before black ops you know black ops 5 black ops 6 black ops gulf war whatever it's gonna be called i don't know if i'm gonna just genuinely have the time because with the reveal of that rolling around and elden ring dlc in the summer and with how much time my job is 
taking it's taking like 40 hours a week which is i'm happy don't worry i'm not complaining about the time i'm happy that i'm getting consistent pay but i'm just like i want to play more video games <laughs> i really want to play some more games i'm not even gonna like sugarcoat it and lie so i don't know if i'll be able to go for the grind it would take a decent amount of grinding each day and when most of my grinding is gonna be done within a 30 minute time span i already have enough money to pack a punch and it's not even the end of end of the mission so i'm definitely gonna head over and pack a bunch of the grenade launcher and then all i can do is just farm all i'm gonna do is just farm the contracts get my special zombies i think i have yeah i have two out of ten which i feel like for an escort is pretty lackluster only getting two there it goes there's number three. Oh, that's number four that's what i need there we go what is that fucking noise that should be number five, actually. I got three on this very end, but that's really fucking nice. Really fucking nice. There we go. Yeah, them they doubling the sat the stash size in zombies is so good. But if they would fix the god damn containment level issue that'd be even fucking better i had my containment level reset probably three or four times now and it's like don't get me wrong i was gonna do this challenge with or without the containment levels and i was gonna just do what i can and i'm perfectly fine with that i'm but if the containment level constantly gets reset i don't even think it should be a, a thing in the game and i'm only saying that because for me to watch my containment level that i grinded up i think in the first couple days to go from 103 or something like that to zero it's just a bit like what's the point of me actively wanting to do the contract i might as well just go back to hard focusing on my you know my camos and stuff like that i'm back here also on some mouse and keyboard and it's funny because i actually did something i guess i don't know if it's stupid or i, I mean it's pretty just fucking moronic for me i guess i'm playing playing on nothing but controller trying to you know learn controller i even did a, a stream over my twitch channel where i was like learning controller i was doing the camo grind and going through the charms and stuff like that and i packed my controller away with my ps5 which is currently ready to go back to go to my house i don't know why i did that i just probably was like oh pa put all my playstation stuff together that's great because i'm putting the playstation away i'll create videos using that when, when i get to the new house and i packed it all away i can tr honestly i my tracking is just better on mouse and keyboard i think however i'm getting some major problems in my wrist mainly my left wrist i don't know why but i mean it's probably some type of carpal tunnel that i'm developing but my wrist just is in so much pain like i'm playing for for long periods of time and I don't stretch it. I used to never have this issue, but I did also notice that I'm doing a little bit of wrist stretches, and if I play on controller, the pain goes. Don't want myself to be in pain, because if I was doing that, all that shit, I'd probably just be on mouse and keyboard practicing. Okay, I mark speed call on the map, because I'm gonna need it for the green launcher, definitely. I already have PhD, and I have stamina up to kind of run away. I'm doing this smg without speed cola, which, I'm gonna be honest, in this iteration of zombies, you need speed cola and stamina up. You just the maps are just so big. You need it. The RG Lob Monster. The Arg Lob. Cool. Zircon's done. Now I can just absolutely kill everything with this. Oh god, this thing is gonna take forever to reload. Oh, it didn't. That wasn't that bad. Why is this Mangler specifically taking like zero damage? Hey, I got a kill streak out of it though. Hey, I got four. Hey, I'll fuck it. I'll take that. All right, now I need to fucking get a vehicle. I still don't know what the fuck this does. I, I'm still super psyched for the, like, next season. We're supposed to be getting the Spas 12 Akimbo I saw from a Twitter page. I don't remember which page I saw from, unfortunately. But I saw it that we're supposed to be getting the Spas 12 with an Akimbo attachment. We already have the Model 1887 with Akimbo, and we're going to be getting this as well. We're going to be, like, in multiplayer-wise, and probably a shotgun meta of some description. Everyone's going to be running around with these Model 1887s, and they're going to be running around with these Spaz 12s if they also get a kit. We might be in a shotgun meta anyways, and I just might be delusional. Serpent tonight on the grenade launcher. All right, now I'm just going to fucking leave. Nice. I totally participated in that, and I 100% contributed to ev everything i could have done very nice so just to keep you guys posted on the content schedule for the future so this week is gonna act like normal tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday there might not be an upload i'm gonna do my best to get an upload ready for saturday because i'll be helping my mother move and when i help my mom move i will i literally will be leaving this house at like 8 a.m and i won't be back till 9 or 10 p.m most likely so i wouldn't be able to get an upload out saturday and then sunday will roll around sunday will be normal monday will be normal tuesday will hopefully you know be normal wednesday will be normal and then th uh thursday will roll around and when thursday rolls around i'll be out of town i'll be taking care of some 
matters that I just choose to not discuss at this time. But I'll, I'll discuss them at some point. I just haven't decided when. You know, when that's done, I'll be coming back and then I'll be moving. And I'm hoping to have the regular upload schedule and such on mm, Sunday, maybe even Monday on Memorial Day. And then when that's done, we'll 100% you know, be settled in I'll, and it'll be groovy. Oh, and I got it right at the very end. Very fucking nice. Oh, and it didn't reset my containment level, it seems. So that's very fucking nice. I hope they put out a fix for that sooner rather than later. Because that shit is actually really annoying. Like, whenever you go to do the containment level stuff. And then it just resets out of nowhere. So, yeah, you're like 20, 30, 40 levels that you've done are back to zero. Okay, so I extracted. I got the AMR and the RGL80 done. Add those to the spreadsheet. Now, I just need to do pistols core 45 and the renetti which i will start the grind for after i've edited this video but thank you guys for hanging out really do appreciate it if you guys did enjoy it make sure you leave a thumbs up in the video it really helps the channel grow it lets me know that you're enjoying the content don't forget to subscribe for more videos in the future until next time this is dia signing off have a fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you in the next video peace guys